guys, it's Aileen here. Uh, it's been a while since I filmed anything, just like sitting in my room. The last time I filmed an unboxing video, I think it was my Ariel cosplay. But today, I have a very special unboxing. You read the title, um, it is a Rapunzel wig. This is going to be my second Rapunzel wig, actually technically my third Rapunzel wig. I have one braided one from the Magical Designs, and then I have the super super long, just down style from Wig is Fashion. And then I also have like her short brown hair. So technically it's my fourth, <laughs> but who's counting? I guess I'm just starting a Rapunzel wig collection. Uh, this one was by Twigs by Charlotte. I'm gonna put all her information here as well as down in the description. She is the nicest person ever and she makes the most glorious princess wigs you will ever see in your life. I can't recommend her enough. My Ariel wig, if you remember, is by her as well. But she also does realistic wigs too. She makes a really, really gorgeous Hermione wig. And I don't know how she does it, but she can make it look like a cartoon wig or a super realistic wig. She's just all around amazing. Uh, not to mention this package came to me in literally like two days. So, um, we've been wanting to collab to make a Rapunzel wig for me um, for about a year now, but it's finally happening and I'm so excited. I have the package right here. So here is the package. It's bigger than me. I don't know if you can see this, but the magnitude of this box. <laughs> it's ginormous and I'm so excited. I feel like I might have to like stand up to open this, literally. Okay. So we've switched angles. I think this is a better sort of vantage point um, for me to open this box. Let's open this. Are we ready? I'm not even ready. So excited. It's like Christmas morning. Oh, it's open. So it's always wrapped super well, and she always puts her little business card here. Thanks for choosing Twigs with a wig net, which is very handy. And the packing peanuts are 100% biodegradable and compostable. We appreciate you, Twigs. It's the biggest box ever. No. No! This is just a little something extra to say sorry for taking so long. I know you cosplay Hermione a lot and use your own hair. This is for the times when you can't. I'm actually gonna cry! Are you serious? Oh my god! No! Are you kidding me? There's two wigs in here. Oh my god. You guys don't even know how much this means to me. I have a wig here that I was supposed to make Hermione and I was stressing so much about it and I didn't want to work on it at all and I was just so not inspired and didn't want to do it and like was like it's probably not even going to turn out nice like and I was literally just talking about her Hermione wigs. Like, she makes a really really gorgeous Hermione wig. Oh my god. Are you kidding me? extra head to put it on. <gasps> She's so gorgeous! <laughs> so this is the lace front style with like the beautiful ombre. Um, so like the darker roots. It actually kind of looks like my, my hair's super short right now. It's in a bun, but I'm in love. I'm so happy. Break to text sisters. Okay, on to Rapunzel. Oh, I see her. I don't know how to get her out though. because She's taking up the whole box. So I feel like I have to like take out the peanuts first. But I definitely want to also keep her like in this to transport it. Um, that's what I do with my other Rapunzel wig. I just keep it in the box and I just bring the whole box with me. Um, but it's literally the only way to travel with her. Like, oh my god. How do I get her out? 
What do I do? <gasps> oh. I can't even lift it, you guys. <gasps> Oh my god, I don't need a workout. Wow. Can you even? It's still going. It's still going. Okay, okay. She's out. I'm going to put the box down. Oh my gosh. I am in pure shock right now. This is glorious. Like, there's literally no other word to describe this. This is a work of art. I'm so scared that I'm gonna just, like, mess this up somehow. But that's the front. So she's a lace front, um, golden blonde. She sewed on this beautiful lace um, to back the braid so that it can sit nicely on your body um, without like chafing and without um, the hair getting all messed up. Wow, that that's genius actually. That's really smart. My other one, my magical designs one, isn't like that. And the braid, it's in a net, but like the way that it's like chafes against my costume, it's starting to, the braid is starting to come out because of that. So this is actually really smart. Look at the bottom. Oh, it's like gorgeous and curly and all the flowers are actually accurate. To Rapunzel's. Let's try her on, shall we? How does one even? First, I'm actually gonna cut the lace. So I'm actually gonna use my um, Velcro wigs, wig fastener, wig secure, wig secure. This really helps the wig stay on because it's like velvety so it gives the wig something to grip. I talked about it briefly in my Wigs 101 video. I need like five people helping me do this. Okay, I have it on, guys. I have it on. So, guys, I have it on. <laughs> it's staying on my head, but it's wanting to pull back a lot because I don't have, like, the fasteners to the back of my costume or anything. Um, so definitely when I'm gonna wear this with my costume, I'm gonna be sewing on snaps. But here's the back <laughs> in all its glory. I love the fact that my Magical Designs one goes over the shoulder, more like the Parks Rapunzel, and this one doesn't. This one is just down the back, like like the movie, like actually more accurate to the movie. Um, I always kind of wanted one that looked more accurate to the movie, so this absolutely works for that. It's glorious, it is extremely heavy, um, so but it's actually staying on my head. Like, the only thing is it's, like, making my neck hurt a bit. It's not that it's falling off. Like, it's literally staying on my head. It's just that it wants to go back. So my neck is straining. Um, so definitely some snaps on the back of your costume will resolve that. That's also another reason why she put the lace down the back, is so that you can um, sew your own snaps um, to the lace that she put, and then just snap it in place to the back of your costume, and that's gonna resolve, like, all of the weight tension. And you can definitely put as many snaps as you want, so I'm probably gonna put about six or eight snaps, so, like, two, four, six, eight, down my back. But it's glorious! I'm so happy! I feel gorgeous! I honestly could not be happier. She's just so majestic. And I'm gonna be doing a photo shoot with this wig in the next few weeks. But I'm gonna put all the footage in this video so you'll get to see a glorious Rapunzel montage. Once again, a huge thank you to Twigs by Charlotte. Everybody go check her out. Thanks for watching this video and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!